So you're interested in becoming an automotive paint technician and you're not really sure where to start. Hey guys, my name is Garrett. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Today's video, I'll be telling you how to get started in automotive paint. If you're new around here, make sure you subscribe. Every Wednesday at 7 p.m., I upload a brand new video on my 1986 Jeep Grand Wagoneer project and I'm hoping to paint it within the next year or so. So if you like auto body and paint, Make sure you subscribe for Wagoneer Wednesdays at 7 p.m. Now let's get straight into it. So I've made more of a longer video in the past covering this topic. So in this video, I'm gonna keep it a little bit short and sweet. Also, I've made a complete playlist on auto body and paint, career advice, and day in the life of videos. All sorts of videos just like that, so make sure you check out this playlist right here. If you're graduating high school soon or you're looking to spice things up in your life and make a career change, the first thing I would do on how to get into this field, number one, do not go to school and I'll tell you why. You can either spend six months to a year or two years at a trade school or a community college, spend all this time and just to come and find out that, hey, you don't even like it. And you're also out five, 10, 15, 20 grand, however much that program costs. So number one, hop straight into a shop. Whether you have to go door to door to these shops, smile, hand them your resume, give them a good handshake, tell them you're willing to do whatever it takes, whether you have to sweep the floors, clean the cars, do whatever, do whatever it takes. Also, these businesses will train you to what they are looking for specifically in each tech. Also, I would not go to an independent shop. I would try to get my foot in the door at a dealership. Dealerships have more people working for them so they can offer better rates on benefits, 401k. Usually they have uniforms that they'll wash and dry for you. And most importantly, they'll have training. Sometimes dealerships will set you up with some online courses you can take to get certificates or they'll send you away to a school. And most importantly, they have PPE ready for you to go. That's personal protective equipment. In my experience, smaller independent shops don't always like to spend that extra coin and go the extra mile for their employees. So get your foot in the door at a dealership. I think one of the biggest myths in this industry on how to get started is you have to go to school and that couldn't be further from the truth. I didn't go to school. I started out by getting my foot in the door at a Mako here in the Detroit area. I started by sanding and prepping and sweeping. And the only sort of experience I had was I put a sunroof in one of my cars. I had no idea what I was doing. It was the first time I was ever using Bondo. So long story short, don't go to school. Start applying online for automotive painter helpers car painter helper, painter prepper, and you can also start walking into shops and telling them you are eager to work. So if they see a nice cleaned up young man or woman walk into the shop with a desire to learn, you're more than likely gonna get that job, regardless if you have experience or not. Hopefully this video helps. Make sure you check out my auto body and paint career advice playlist. I have a ton of videos on that playlist and I'm always expanding, trying to answer people's questions. So if you found value in this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions, comment them down below. I'll do my best to answer them as soon as possible. And make sure you subscribe for Wagoneer Wednesdays at 7 p.m. Thank you so much for watching. Take care and hopefully we'll see you in the next one.
Me off my feet and then puts me down again. 